What is going on today, guys? Today, we are back out on the boat, and we are gonna be doing some more magnet fishing at this bridge right here behind me. Now, this is a brand new spot we have never been to before, and as you can tell, there's just about nothing but trees around us. Now, I'm thinking, because this bridge is so far out in the country here, you just never know who's coming out here to dump stuff. I found it on Google Earth, and I figured we had to give it a shot. It is absolutely gorgeous gorgeous out here today you guys it's like 80 degrees so we're gonna get right down to it let's strap on the gopro start dipping the magnet around and let's see if we can find anything here today today i got my large 360 degree magnet with me the game plan is to poke all around this bridge on both sides and we're gonna see what we can find so let's get right down to it let's start tossing fingers crossed hopefully we can find some stuff Ooh, just stuck something for a second though. The heck was that? I think it came off. Unless it, no, there's something on here, you guys. I think anyway, feels a little heavier. Yeah, here we go, my first find of the day. Oh, it's orange. What the heck is that? Looks like just some kind of square steel plate or something there, but uh, that caught my eye because it's orange. Honestly, I don't think that's nothing too fancy, you guys. First find of the day, a little bit of cash money for the cart. I'm pulling something again. Oh, this one's kind of heavy. Heaviest thing so far today. Heck yeah. Whoa, what is that? Almost looks like some kind of lever or some kind of crank or something what the heck do you guys think that is see again look at all of the rust cake down here that's how you know this stuff has been down there forever it looks like some kind of big old bolt type lever deal i really don't know huh oh something something grabbed me down there what is that Oh my, I don't like that. Give me my magnet back at the very least, please. Oh no, dude. Um, oh, there it goes. Oh my gosh. I don't know what that was. I hate that feeling. Oh, oh and I grabbed something. Doom, I got my magnet unstuck and then grabbed something heavy. Oh, what is that? Hold on, wash her off a little bit here. Get some of that mud off of there. What the heck do we got here, you guys? Looks like two pieces, actually. Check this out, you guys. I think the, these are definitely two separate pieces, but they're like rusted right together. This one here looks like just some ugly bridge metal or something, the old scrap. But what the heck do you guys think this thing is with the old threads or the twisties on there? Looks like some kind of brace or something. There it is. I can only get whatever this is. I can only get it so high and then it comes off. Right here, it's gonna come off. Nope. Here it comes. Oh my gosh, it's, no, there it goes. Mm. I gotta get this, dude, I almost had it. I almost had it. Whatever this is, now I know it, it's it's grabbable and it's I, I can get it up. I just gotta go slow and take my time or do whatever I gotta do. I'm getting this up. No, there it goes again, bro. That's like the third time I've gotten it up to the point where I could see it and then it just slides off. I gotta get my hand down there and get ready to grab that sucker. Come here. It's super heavy, dude. Here we go, I can see the magnet again. Okay, hold on, hold on. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, it's a chain, big chain, hold on. Oh, why are both ends heavy? Both ends of this thing are heavy, hold on. I'm gonna step on the chain there. All right, we're gonna pull up one side of this chain at a time. Both ends are heavy, dude, this is a heavy duty chain. Wow, what's on the end of this? 
Oh, holy hook. Look at that sucker. You see a little yellow on there. I thought I was feeling something heavy on there, you guys. It looks like it was just the weight of the chain itself. So there's a hook on that end. What's on this end? Okay, this is heavy. That's heavy. Whoa, yo, what's that? Some kind of ring in the middle? Oh my gosh, there's like a, there's like a double attachment thing here. One chain's got a hook, and what's on the other end? Another hook? Or is there something on here? Oh my gosh, that is so heavy. Oh, oh my gosh. Come here. Dude, it looks like, again, nothing on there but a big old hook. You guys, look at how much chain that is there. Holy cow. Holy cow, you guys. So we got, I don't know, must be some kind of tow chain or something. Each end's got a hook, and then there's like this connector piece here with the big old loop that I'm assuming maybe you would attach this end to like your truck or whatever you're pulling with. I can't even pick this all up to throw it in there all at once. It's so heavy. Oh, here we go. I just grabbed something. As this guy goes flying by, now I'm gonna start rocking and back and forth. Oh, what the, yo. Oh, hold on a second. I see something else on there. Yup, you guys, look at what this is. Dude, that's a shotgun shell. That's pretty cool. Look at that, you guys. What is that, a 12 or a 20 gauge? I guess I can't really tell. Based on how much rust is on the casing here, it looks like that sucker's been down there for quite a while, but check it out. That sucker is fully loaded yet. Probably the buckshot, maybe from a, from a duck hunter or something. Who knows? And then we caught what looks like a big old T-post here. Yep. Every time I catch one of these poles like this, you guys, I always think it's a sign on the way up. And then we get to this part and I find out it's not a sign. Don't just the old T-Post cash money. Ooh, something here. See if I can suck it out of the mud. Yeah, here it comes. Faux show. What do we got here? Ooh, that's kind of heavy too. Oh, dude. Hold on a second. Well, first of all here, look at this. A little twisty wire with the loop on there. But let's get out in the sunlight and check this out here. Look at this thing, man. What do you think that is? Looks like some kind of, I don't know, something with threads on there. Like you could screw something on that part, but there's like valves and knobs on here. What the heck? Do you guys think this thing is? And then you got this thing, what is that? Again, tons of rust on this thing. This had to be down there for at least 50 years, who knows? I don't have a single clue what this could be, you guys, but this shirt is super cool looking. That's something kind of heavy. Here we go, if we can get this up. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, what the heck do we got here? Hold on, let's wash this sucker off again. Get the mud off of there. Here we go. What do we got? Ooh, color. Look at that bright neon green jig. You guys, I broke the rust right off of that hook. Honestly, this thing is good to go. Just a couple cents, nothing too crazy. But check this out, you guys. Does this not look like that same piece we found before? Yeah, it is with the, with the threads on there and the old TNT pump looking thing. You guys, now we caught another one. And this one, I mean, now you can tell these are supposed to be together. That's like creepy. What is that like you stick your head in there and whoosh, chop your head off or what? Oh, that's a finger chopper. That's what it is. Huh. Oh, here we go. Something pretty heavy. 
and we're out like i want to say maybe throwing distance from the bridge now we're not directly underneath that sucker what do we got oh my goodness this is actually super heavy oh no you guys look at i caught me an anchor dude no chain or no rope on there or nothing but that's the old three prong which is the same kind of anchor that i use it almost doesn't matter what kind of anchor you find if you find an anchor it's worth like at least 20 bucks so boom we just caught us 20 bucks and the way anchors work i mean something like this you really don't even need to clean up you just throw a rope on there and she good to go i have such a huge pile of anchors at home you guys it is getting silly now we're talking oh i grabbed me something up here Let's see if i can get it up we're swirling oh color what's going on here Ooh, what do we got dude what is this hold on oh and there's something else shiny on there too you guys first of all what do you think that is oh yo is this a safe door i think it might be you guys like that's the keyhole and maybe it's kind of what it looks like man dude okay where was that kind of like right here ish but you guys we also had something else shiny on there look at it dude no flipping way you know what this is this is the coin slot off of a vending machine you drop your quarter in there you spin this thing and your candy comes out the bottom oh and now that i'm thinking about it this is probably like the the money case cover for the candy machine i bet you any money there's a whole candy machine sitting down there you guys it's gotta be we gotta keep tossing i want to see if we can find it what the heck I can't believe we just found that, you guys. Parts to a candy machine. And if there's the parts, we, there's got to be the machine down there, ain't it? I wonder if it's just maybe too big that we might not be able to lift it up. Who knows? We'll see. Let's keep tossing. I got something here. The very next throw. This sucker's heavy, too. What do we got, you guys? I think this is right in the same area. Kind of. What do we got here? Hoo, hoo. Oh, what the heck do we got here? Whoa, there's like, dude, there's wood on there too. What the heck is this, you guys? Looks like part of maybe an old, like an old workhorse or something, like the old work table, maybe? I don't know, you guys. Definitely some metal brackets or braces on there, but this is definitely some wood. Holy cow, you guys. Here we go. What's this? Oh, whoa, what is this? What the heck we got going on here? Looks like a couple things, guys. First of all, check this out, dude. Oh, look at who just came flying out of there. What you doing, Frank? Chill out. I got gotcha. you. You guys, look at, ow, ow, let go. I'm trying to help you. Let go, Frankie. All right, well, whatever. Hold on then. You guys, we pulled Frankie right out of his hotel here. You think anybody else is in there? No, I don't think so. He didn't have no fam. Frankie is single. Well, you and me both, Frankie. Go on. But this piece we were looking at when Frankie fell out. Look at this, you guys. This is like definitely some kind of old school plate or something. Or maybe a bowl. Pretty cool, man. Look at how old that thing looks. I mean, seriously, somebody's probably eating a bowl of cereal out of this thing 60 years ago. here whoa, 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 whoa. we're really swirling with this thing oh yo what is this oh i thought that was all one piece no this is separate dude look at you guys it looks uh, yeah look at that's a keyhole for sure you can tell just looking at it and same thing over here so what is this two keyholes on what looks like another door flap or something? But what kind of like door flap would this be to? Like a small safe or something? I don't know. There's definitely some stuff down there for sure. Holy cow. Oh, 
something here. This is pretty heavy, actually. Oh, what is this? Whoa. Oh, look at a bright lure hanging off of there, too. Hold on. What do we got? First of all, yeah, check this lure out, you guys. Oh, that sucker looks like it might be junk, though. What do you think that is? Definitely some kind of box, or at least it used to be. Look at that. Looks like there's knobs on there or something. What in the world, man? Whatever this thing is, this is super old. Again, another something that had to have been in there for at least 50 years, it looks like. What the heck do you even think that is? The old mystery box. That's something. Oh, some white. What do we got here? Dude, okay. What is going on here, yo? This one's all dented right up. But again, you can see where the keyhole would have been and it looks like another door flap. Are these seriously coming off of like safes or something? I mean, it's super bent up. Looks like somebody took a hammer and just whack. Holy smokes, dude. <laughs> nah, -uh. really you guys i found a second shotgun shell yep look at no kidding and it looks like the exact same kind same color same everything man that would be super cool if we could find an actual shotgun in here pew, pew. Oh, here we go. Dude, no flipping way. Another shotgun shell. Seriously, look at the rust just caked on there. Obviously, there's not gonna be anything on the plastic, but you can just tell how long these have been sitting down there. It's starting to make me wonder, maybe somebody like tipped their boat or dropped a, a whole box of bullets. There could be a gun down there. That would be wild. Pew, pew, pew. Something way out here. Heck yeah, way out here. This is throwing distance from the bridge for sure. You ain't dropping nothing out this far. Oh, what is that? Is that even gonna come up or what? Oh my gosh, that's heavy. Oh, um, yo. What the? Oh, dude, I found it. I flipping found the machine, you guys. Oh my gosh! You gotta be kidding me! Look at Oh my gosh, man! I found the whole candy machine, you guys. I knew if I just kept tossing, I'd find this sucker. Wait a minute. This piece here just fell off. If we put that there, that makes all three of those slots complete. Which means the one that's in the cart, you guys, is an extra. Which means there's another one down there. At least there's gotta be. Oh! And I figured it out too, you guys. Hold on a second. Let me grab this cover here. This cover goes right here. And actually this one here is too small for this machine. So uh, dude, there's gotta be like at least two or three of these machines down there. Holy cow, you guys, look inside there. No candy. What do you think they were keeping in there? M&Ms? Anybody need some candy? It still says the candy is 25 cents here. So, I mean, it wasn't like super old back when it was maybe five cents or something like that. Absolutely unbelievable, you guys. This is something that I'm definitely gonna restore or at least clean up anyways. And we're standing this sucker up in the garage, man. Ooh, I just clicked something decent. That's pretty heavy. Where'd it go? Wink right there. That's slapped. 
it sounded hollow inside like I just slapped onto a box. This is pretty heavy, dude. I got something. Oh, dude, no freaking way. Oh, oh, dude, whoa. I'm at a loss for words just looking at this right now. Shut your lips, you guys. There's no flipping way. There's a handle on the side. What is this thing? Oh, if you look even closer, look at like it says dollar signs. Nine dollars, eight dollars. There's like some kind of dial right here. You guys, what is this? This is super cool. You guys, what the heck? That is so cool. Oh, uh, excuse me. That'll be nine dollars, please. I've never seen anything like this before, you guys. I thought it was a typewriter or something at first, but the more I'm looking at it, dude, I don't know. I don't think that's what it is. This is absolutely insane. Holy cow. You guys, now we're laying into some stuff. And of course, with that, here comes the dark clouds. I really hope we don't get rained out, dude, because I don't want to leave yet. Not now. Unreal, man. Let's keep tossing. I'm just waiting for any moment now to just start feeling raindrops on my head. And then it's gonna be game over. No, no, really? Oh my gosh, you guys. So now, look at what that is. A fourth shotgun shell. And they're all unfired. So I'm starting to seriously think somebody dumped an entire box or something happened. Because ammunition is not cheap, you guys. Like, so I couldn't imagine somebody just took a handful of bullets and tossed them in the river. This is unreal, man. that yo something on there heck yeah huh? look at this some kind of container some kind of canister what the heck do you guys think this is look at a couple threads on this end like you could screw something on there and then if you look at the other end here again looks like you could screw something on there with a couple threads you guys what in the world is this wait a minute there's something in there probably a bunch of mud i would think honestly kind of looks like something off a vehicle or maybe a boat who knows oh my gosh look at who's down here oh he's pinched on the magnet frankie oh we got him out of there no way that's a big old frankie holy smokes he's trying to get away go on frankie we saved you Something heavy way out here. See, I mean, we are, this is beyond throwing distance from the bridge. So I'm really starting to think that the older bridge might have been out here farther. Oh, something's gonna fall off. No, that's not gonna, or it is. Oh my gosh, that's heavy. What in the world is this? Oh, what the? Yo, we crossed the old prison bars. What the heck is that? Ah, is this maybe like part of the railing or something like that from the old bridge? It very well could be, man. Just look at how old that metal is. We're in prison. Help! Somebody let me out! We are finding all kinds of stuff now. Look at, we got the brand new cart with the brand new big old bin. And look at, uh, oh, oh my gosh, we already filled this sucker up. I'm pulling something here. Yeah. What do we got here? Whoa. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Look at all. Stop. Look at. Oh my gosh. Look at all the little bugs squirming around down there. What the heck? What in the world do you think this is? Looks like some kind of tray and it looks like it obviously broke off of here or something man we are finding some cool funky stuff something going on here 
Yeah, I didn't even want to say anything though, because the way it felt was like it was just going to come off. Uh, what that was. There it is again. Well, this time it's coming up. Yeah. Yo. Oh my gosh, there's a string. Oh, <gasps> and there's a brick. Oh my gosh, you guys. There's a giant, yup. Like somebody tied this and threw it in the river. What's on the other end, man? Nothing? Look though, look. You can see they tied a loop like, like this was tied to something. And the string is not that long, you guys, look. Yup, they like hand tied this to a brick. Somebody tried to sink something. 100% for sure, it was wrapped around something. Is that not like the size of a body? That's a little creepy the more I think about it. I could put this right over my head. Yep, uh, it would like fit around my waist. Oh man, I'm like creeped out. Honestly, that is freaky to think about. I don't know. It seems like whatever it was slipped right out of there at some point. That's messed up, yo. There's some weight on here all of a sudden. I think we definitely snatched us up something. Whoa, yo, what the flip? What the heck is that, yo? Supra, oh, and I didn't even notice that too. Look at, we got us a fishing reel. But you guys, what is this man, Supra? That's like a trail camera or something, ain't it? Maybe. No, it's like a lock, you can tell. What the heck do you think that was locking? Oh, right here, Supra Box. What does that say? Supraproducts.com. Well, we're gonna have to Google that one. At first, I thought it was like a trail cam, but no, there's definitely like a locking mechanism on there. And if you look, one of the metal pieces is gone, like somebody snipped it or something. What in the world? Um, I just grabbed something there, the last touchdown. Yep, here we go, right as I was about to pick it up. The heck we got here? Oh, look at you guys. That's a big old horseshoe. Super cool, man. We caught us a little bit of good luck. Something here. Yes. Yes. It's actually coming up. Yeah, here we go. Oh. Oh. No. Oh, it's falling right apart. Boy, that one's been down there for a while. You guys, look it. I think this is like a cash register. I'm pretty sure, man. Like, this is the the drawers off of it? No way. Holy cow, man. I guess I could be wrong. There is only th three slots in there. Wow, that thing is just falling right apart. Tick, 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 ting. Do you imagine if we pulled up a whole cash register with the drawer and it was full of money? That would be wild. So check it out, you guys. This is some of the cool stuff. A lot of it was scrap and not all of this is from today either. Then I found this brick here that's got like a rope tied to it and it's kind of spooky because if you look at the loop on the end of it, I mean, that's, you could fit like a, like a body in there. <laughs> I don't know, man. Somebody tried to weigh something down for sure. You can see they hand tied it to this brick. Then I found this thing here. Not really sure what the heck this is. Got some valves and knobs on there. Not too sure about that one, you guys. Super cool looking though. Then I found this fishing reel here. Look at that sucker. Couldn't find the fishing pole, but even if I did, that sucker wouldn't be good to go anyways. Super old. I wonder what the year is on that one. Then we caught this old horseshoe or what I thought was a horseshoe but if you look at the spikes on the tip there it looks like they grinded it down to be used as a logging spike and we found tons of these before super cool then I found this drawer here this is plastic but it fell out of like a 
what, what was like a metal frame. I thought it was like a cash box out of like a, like a register or something, but I guess there's only three slots. So I don't know if that's what that is or not. Then we got this little tube thing here. I don't know what the heck this thing is, you guys. You can kind of see in there a little bit. On each end though, it's got some tubes. Looks like you can maybe screw something on there. It's got some threads. I'm not sure what this is. Then check this out, you guys. I found five shotgun shells here and they're all unshot super crazy either way look at those shells you guys super rusted out man them things had to be down there forever then i found a couple doors here off of what i thought kind of looked like a candy machine or something but i found not only one two doors this one's a little different but this one here looks similar to this one here the third one that i found now if you look at this one these little holes i'm pretty sure those are actually keyholes so i found three of these doors i'm not really sure what they're for but before i show you the rest of this stuff look at what i found here i found me a big old candy machine you're definitely not getting no candy out of that one no more that is super crazy though how long you think that one was down there then i found me this toaster Strap here this thing is absolutely massive and it's got the double notch hooker here so you could really tow some stuff then i found some kind of tray here you guys not really sure what this might have came off of then i caught me an anchor man i absolutely love finding anchors that's a solid 20 dollars resell easily and then moving over here you guys this thing i don't know what this is at first i thought it was like a typewriter or something but if you look at the numbers they're all like repetitive and it's not like a phone dial i mean there's not like a one two three four five they're all like eight 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 eighty seven 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 seventy like what the heck could this be a couple red buttons over here you guys i don't know man this little dial i've never seen anything like this and it's got like a ka-ching ka-ching what do you think that is and last but not least out of all the cool stuff i found today you guys check this out the old supra and it looks like some kind of lock or something like it was snapped and if you check the back out, what does it say? Supra Eye Box. Pretty crazy. You guys, we found tons of super crazy, super cool stuff today. And I bet you any money, there's got to be tons left at that spot. Today, we are going to be magnifishing this old country bridge that we've only magnifished one other time. The last time we were out here, you guys, we found tons of seriously crazy stuff. So today, we're back out here once again. We're going to give it another shot, hopefully. Fingers crossed, there's still some juicy stuff in here. So we're not gonna waste any time. We're gonna get right down to it. I'm gonna strap on this GoPro. We're gonna start tossing our magnet around this bridge and we're gonna see if we can find anything else here today. Today I have my large 360 degree magnet with me. Owen has the medium 360 magnet. We're gonna get right down to it, start tossing around here and see if we can find anything today. What is going on here? Oh, I just yanked something up out of the mud. Dude, this is heavy. Hold on a second, yo. Oh, no, it came off. Or wait, I'm still pulling something though. No, what the heck is this? Of course it is. If you watched our last video here, we found so much rebar, you guys. It was ridiculous. There is so much of it in here. It's crazy. Oh, I'm smacking on some stuff again, right under the bridge here. Might just be a massive pile of rebar, who knows. <laughs> but hidden in the rebar could be some goodies. You never know. That's how that goes. Ooh, some treasure. Here we go, I got something heavy again. Yeah, here we go, something heavy. Right under the bridge again. Um. Whoa, that's not uh, no regular looking rebar. Look at that one, it's like all zigzaggy and twisty twirly. What the heck is that off of? It seems like a piece of rebar, but I've never seen one looking like that. Well, again, you guys, we might as well consider that one another piece of rebar. It's a snake. Something here. Oh, that's heavy. Here we go. Oh my gosh, that's like actually really heavy. Oh, 
Yo, what the? Oh my gosh, what is this? Dude, what the heck is this? First of all, look at the color of this thing. That's like a, like a metallic or maybe not. I don't, I don't know what the heck I'm talking about metallic wise, but uh, I mean, that paint looks like a, something off a vehicle. Yeah, look at that, you guys. It's like a brownish, copperish color. What the heck do you think this is? It almost looks like there's hinges here, like this could open or something. I don't really know, you guys. Holy smokes, man. A boat? I don't have a clue. Definitely some kind of paint, you guys. I can't, I can't think of what that could be off of. Oh, you guys. I'm looking inside this thing. Hold on. Hold the heck on, yo. I see him. Yo, yeah, right here. Got right here. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, he's trying to get away. He's trying to get away. Oh, there's a crayfish. Oh, there's a crayfish, too. First of all, you guys, look at a little bit of Franken. Get out of here. No. But we're looking at this guy right here. Look at this. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's like a salamander or something. Oh. Yeah, there's, yeah, look at That's like a lizard. What do you call those? Um, a guppy me. or something? I think. I can't don't remember. I don't know if these are supposed to be invasive or what, you guys. I, I, I've only ever seen these like twice. That is wild. It's literally like a salamander. All right, we're sending them back. He's like, no. Oh, here we go. What is that? I laid into something. Is it gonna come up though? Oh, here we go, hold on. Oh my goodness, that's seriously heavy. That's heavier than that painted piece we just pulled up. Oh, hold on, here it comes. Oh, yo, whoa, what is this? Wait a minute. Dude, I think this is another piece of it. I think it is. Yeah, it's like the other half or something because you can see well, you know the hinges on is. here. And look at there's more paint on there. Dad, you know what, that actually is? what do you think that is? That was actually like a, a, one of those things that connect to your house. But that is a car door. That's what I was going to say. I think this is like a car hood or something almost. Just the way it's like kind of shaped like a super, super old school car hood. I guess I really don't know you guys. Oh, look at who's hanging out the side. Come here, Franken. Come on. I got him. <laughs> He's flipping out. Holy smokes, you guys. We got us another Frankie. What is this? Number two? Two Frankies and a salamander. All right, let's send him back. I didn't even think there was anything on there, you guys. I see a one little nail, a bunch of bunch of rocks. Some are colored on there. Those are kind of cool. But look at this, man. We cost the old double A. And look at that thing. The wrapping is like falling right off of there. Ooh, I should probably leave that on there. It's like acid coming out of there, I think. Energizer. Bzz, bzz. Can you get her up or what? Yeah. Ooh. Just a piece of rebar. Big old piece of rebar. Man, I'm telling you, I don't I think they threw half the bridge in the river. All right, you guys, for the very first time, we are actually gonna poke around on the other side of the bridge here. I guess I shouldn't say first time because the last time we were here, I poked around a little bit over here, but not much. Here we go. What happened there? Oh, there it is again. I can feel it. it must be stuck in the mud. You need to drop him. Nope, I'll be all right. Hold on. I just got to play with it for a second. Yes. Here it comes. I got it. I'm just going to go super, super duper slow. Whatever that is does not really feel like it's on that great. Whoa, yo, what is this? Oh, it's a pot. Yeah. Holy cow, dude. Wow, look at that sucker. That's huge. We could cook us up some river stew, huh? That boy's thick. That boy thick. <laughs> there is so much rust caked on this thing. Look at on the inside there too. Just unbelievable. How long you think this thing was down there? For like a hundred years. Oh, what? 
what the, that was a good connect. And that feels heavy as can be. Oh yeah, dude, what do I got here? Oh, here we go. This is heavy. Nice and easy, stay on there. Yeah. Oh, what is this? Oh, oh, you know what that is? What? Dude, that's a big old anchor. Oh my gosh. I forget what these ones are called. This isn't like a, this is not a typical anchor. You guys, way too cool, man. This right here, this little piece is supposed to fold down, but I think it's just too rusted up right now. I'm almost positive these are way more expensive than a, than a normal anchor. Heck yeah, you guys, super cool. Ooh, something stuck good. Or kind of good anyways. Feels like it. Oh yeah, what do we got here? Oh, dude! <laughs> no way! Look at what I just found! I got me the old hammerhead! Come here! Ting, ting, tong! Mm. Well, check that one out, you guys. And this does not look like any old hammer when I look at this, honestly. Look at the bottom. Does that not look like the head of a railroad spike? Like, look at this. If I cover up the hammer part, that is 100% a railroad spike, dude. How did they, like, what? Did they, they put a hammer head on a railroad spike as a handle? I've never seen anything like that in my entire life. That's way too cool. Oh, what the heck? Oh, oh, that's a battery, you guys. I'm looking at it like, what the heck is this sticking off of there? It's another Energizer battery, but this one's a big old D. Holy cow, man. And this one looks like it's been in there just about as long as the last one, too. We caught us the old Energizer bunny. Oh, look at what's on there, bingo. Check it out, you guys. We caught us a little bit of good luck. The old good luck horseshoe. And that one's kind of a small guy. That one fits right in my hand. Super cool. Hmm, there we go. Holy cow, I move out a little bit from under the bridge and all of a sudden we're sticking all kinds of stuff now. What we got here? Oh no, this is, um, what the heck is this? I've seen, oh, hold on, hold on, look who's in there. It's a little baby, Frankie. That's a super tiny one, he probably can't even see yet. Where am I, where am I? But you guys, I'm pretty sure this is called a piston head or something. Yep, because it's got the hole through here. I know for a fact, you guys, we have found tons of these before. Oh, I grabbed something here. This is almost the exact same area. I just found that piston head. This is heavy too. Oh my goodness, what do we got? Whoa, what the heck is that? Oh, I seen some white. I'm like, what the? Just the old half a clamoroo. But check this thing out, you guys. Oh, what the heck? There's like some uh, spring or coil on the bottom there. I don't really know what's going on. And then some kind of big old bracket piece. What the heck do you guys think this is? Looks like some kind of lever or something. Er, er, er. All right, man. See, you can see a building over there. This is, looks like somebody's property now, but I guess you never know back in the day, man. You never know what was going on here. Boink, I just stuck something again. You gotta be kidding me. Did we just find like a little honey hole here? Right in this guy's backyard or something? Ooh, yo. Look at that! Some kind of big old gear. Heck yeah, look at all the teeth on that puppy. What the heck you think that was used for? That's a big old heavy duty gear ring.
Oh, dude, I just, <laughs> I definitely just landed right on something. I love when that happens. No, and then I hate when that happens and it comes right off. There it is, right there. Oh, look at all the bubbles. Oh, here we go. I got it. Oh, it's twirling coming up. That's always a good sign, usually. What do we got here? Oh, yo, look at two little itty bitty ugly scrap bits, but look at what I got you guys. Check it out, man. I caught me the old ax head. And look at that one. Nothing left of the handle on there. That's usually how we find them. Super cool, you guys. And realistically, it wouldn't take much to push this wood piece out, slap a new handle in there, sharpen this thing up, and I guarantee you, you could cut logs with this again. Ow. I had a piece of metal poking me through my glove. I need new gloves. Oh, here we go. <laughs> and as I'm dealing with a with a metal splinter, I got something on here. Something's heavy too. Oh my gosh. What is that? Whoa. First of all, look at this, you guys. I think this is like a big old stake or something. Look, you can see the pointy tip on there and then like a bolt head or something, not really sure. But look at this other thing on here. Yeah, this here. What the heck? Ow, ow, ow. What in the world is that? Oh, look it. There's more gears on this thing too. These gears go at like an angle here. What do you think that one's for? Nice, dude, another gear off of something. Who knows what? Oh, here we go. Again, man. Wow, we definitely found us a little hot spot here. That's heavy. Hold on, we're kind of floating towards that trot line. I, I definitely want to stay away from that because that will get us in trouble. Is this actually going to come up? I think it is. Whoa, yo. Whoa. Seriously, what the? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What the heck is this? Look at this thing, dude. I don't know what the heck to think of this. It almost looks like part of the frame off of a chair or something, honestly. Like what the, oh, look at, whatever that is, man. It's been down there forever. It's fallen right apart, but look at, there's like, there's like, I don't know. It's a whole bunch of mechanical stuff going on here. Ooh, look at that. What is that? Oh, that's like a big old jelly sack. There's are some kind of eggs, I think, like frog eggs or what the heck are those? Unreal, man. I don't want to get too close to these boats, but boy, this spot is juicy. Ah, what do I got here? Um, yo, is that what I think it is? Hold on a second. Dude, or at least part of it. I think so. Oh, I think I found part of like a rifle. I'm not even kidding. Like, is this the trigger part? Yeah, it looks a little broken, but if that was connected, dude, oh my gosh. I think I just found part of a rifle or something. Like, like a super old part of a rifle barrel. Look at that one. What the heck is that? Some kind of big old bracket piece. Maybe we're too close to shore now. Should back up a little bit. Or maybe not. Oh, as soon as I say that, I'm... Hold on. Oh, what happened there? Popped off. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. I think that's something. Come to Papa. Here it comes. Yes, I popped it right out. And it's heavy. What do I got? Come to Papa. Oh, what is that one, man? Look at that. At first I thought it was like just gonna be some kind of tube or something, but uh, no. Oh, look at who's in there. Of course there's a little Frank in there. Come on, Frank. 
Oh, oh, he's flipping, flapping. Look at his eyes are covered in mud. He can't even see where he is. Where am I? Where am I? Let me at him. We got us another Frankie. Holy smokes. This is Frankie City around here, you guys. That's like a handful today. Send him back. But you guys, I don't know what to think of this thing, man. It looks like there's almost what looks like spokes or something inside there. Like this is maybe some kind of giant rim. The old solid iron wheel. Aww. Oh, look it. Ah, oh, there's nothing in it though. You know what that is? What? It, it's one of those it's one of those knife holders. Imagine if there was a imagine if there was a knife in there. I know, dude, that's what I'm saying. If there's too bad there's not a knife in there, but look it. It was sealed closed and uh so like, I don't know, there must have not been a knife in there when it, when it entered the water. Well, check that one out, you guys. Super cool. We cost the old Rapala knife holder or something. Something heavy or what? Holy cow, you look like you're gonna fall in. <laughs> Careful, don't, don't. Oh, it's coming. I, at first I thought I was- Oh, going. whoa, what do you got? Oh, <gasps> keep pulling. Grab it, grab is that a sign? What is grab it? it? Grab it! I can't. I can't grab it. Oh, grab it. I got it. I got it. What do we got here? Oh, oh, hold on. Oh, it's just a, it's a big old T post, buddy. Look at that one. Yeah. I thought you were gonna have a sign here. Yep, just a T post. Something here. Oh. Oh my goodness. What is this? Oh, what the heck is this? Hold on. That's not going to come up, is it? Shut your horses. Oh, yo. No. That's a sign. That's Dude, what is this? That is definitely a sign. You think it's a sign, huh? Oh my God, this is by far the heaviest thing of the day. I'm not kidding. Definitely a sign. Oh my God. <laughs> What the heck is that? That's a piece of the bridge. It sure does look like piece of the bridge. Holy cow. Look it, I can see right on the end, right here. That's look it. it, this is some kind of like a trailer hitch for something, maybe like a yard roller or something that would pull behind a, a, a lawnmower. Cause look it, this is a trailer hitch. You can see where the ball would go right up under there. And it's not big enough to be like for a, for a large vehicle. Unbelievable. Look at this cart stacked right up. Oh my gosh. We don't even almost have any room for anything else. Oh, something slapped there. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hit a couple things. Oh, oh yeah. Sure do got a couple things. Yeah, what do we got? Yeah. First of all. Oh, look it. You got our Hold on. Oh, what do you got? Look at that. The old hat hanger. No, the old hat hanger, he says. <laughs> it's, not for, it's not for one. It's for, it's not for two. It's for three. It's for not for one, not for two, but for three. But you guys, look at what I found here. This is a big old hammerhead. It's got the flat head on this side and then like the ball hammerhead on this side. Holy caked rust on that one too, man. I don't think we found a single thing yet that hasn't just been absolutely covered in rust. Heck yeah, you guys, we caught us another hammerhead. Only this one does not have a handle. Still super cool. Oh, it's coming up sideways. Got a little something hanging off of there. What do you got? Oh, that looks like a hinge. That's definitely a hinge. Check that one out, you guys. He just caught himself a little door hinge. A couple things hanging off of there. Oh, look it. First of all, you guys, we caught us a teeny tiny file. I guess it's not teeny tiny. I found ones way smaller than this before, but it is pretty small. It's like a palm file. Come here, let me file your arm off. <laughs> Hamburg. <laughs> Hamburger. Hamburger.
the heck is that? <laughs> what in the world? Is that a, is that a, dude it is. It's a marshmallow poker. Yes. Look at, like 100%. You want to cook some marshmallows or what? Yeah, cook me as a marshmallow. Oh, you want me to cook you as a marshmallow? All right, come here. We caught the old backyard fire cooking utensil. As you can tell, that sun is starting to go down in the background there. It started off super slow, you guys. We weren't finding much but rebar. And then I found us a little hot spot. It is absolutely gorgeous out here. And today we are back out on the boat to do some more magnet fishing at this old country bridge. Now today is gonna be my third time here. I got Alex with me today. Now, every time we come out here, it seems to take me a little bit to find that hot spot. But once I find it, you guys, both times so far, we've left with the cart absolutely loaded over the top with some pretty cool stuff. So we're gonna get right down to it, guys. We're gonna start tossing this magnet around and we're gonna see if we can find anything else in here. Today, we're gonna start out closer to what I think is somebody's private property here. We we ended up the last video in this area right over here and boy, we were smacking it. Let's get right down to it, start tossing around and see what we can find here today. I think I already got something, my very first throw. Ooh, that could be a good sign. Ooh, look at you guys, literally my very first throw. I'm telling you, man, there is some stuff in here. First of all, what the heck is this? Is that like empty? Yeah, what the heck is that? Some kind of cap or cover for something. I'm not really sure. Got a little lip on there. Just a teeny tiny cap for something. And then we had this thing, you guys. Look at the, I don't know, the way this looks with this little point on here that when I first seen it, I thought it was like one of them, uh, one of them logging tools. This part here is definitely a metal tip, but then if you look at this end, I think this is wood. Like it turned into some kind of handle or something, you guys. Heck yeah, man. Literally first throw of the day. We already got us the old two for one. Oh, I just slapped something. I slapped me something for sure. Whoosh. Oh no. Oh no, it's still on there. It feels like it. What the heck's going on? I see some bubbles. Oh, we got a little something here. Oh, fishing line too, ain't it? Oh, uh, nothing on the fishing line. But check this out, you guys. It looks like... I don't know. First, I thought it was just a piece of rebar, but if you look, there's like a hoop or a loop on this end and the same thing going on on this end. Who knows what the heck that thing's coming off of. Oh, it does look like a propeller, like a white propeller. Sure, huh, like what the heck? Like an RC little helicopter. Or, or off an of RC boat. boat. Yeah, Owen's for, got uh, one of those. Oh, really? Yeah, it kind of does look just that like that. Oh, shut up. What, what, what? Oh, look at that. No way, what does that say on there? Look at that, you guys, I caught me a tape measure. What is that, a 10 footer? You guys, holy smokes, man. Look at the red button on there. Look at all the rust. How long do you think that sucker was down there? They probably used this to build the bridge. That's pretty cool, man. Check that one out. The Lufkin. Oh. I got something going on here. Something extremely heavy. Like it shouldn't even be on, I don't think. Uh, oh, what is that? Oh, dude, look at what it is. Oh my gosh. Oh, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. First of all, hold on. That's just rebar. We'll set that down. You guys, hold on. No, no, no. No, no, no. I want that stick. I want the stick on top. Look at this. Hold on. I'm just trying to. No, I don't want the stick to fall off. I got it. Dude, what? Dude, it 
it's one of those is this system is that one of them uh Gel sacks? yeah we thought it was like an look at they're thing. like it's like a i don't know that is weird that's man. like an egg sack or something stuck to a stick dude dinosaur <laughs> egg, dude. Dinosaur egg. <laughs> <laughs> i don't know man on real it's definitely like jelly Look at that, blah, blah, blah. we definitely gotta throw that back. We're tossing that back for sure. But you guys, look at this bike, man. This is what that big old sack was attached to. Holy cow. Look at this one, man. This one's been down there forever. Wow. It's Lance Armstrong's bike. <laughs> Dude, wow, man, look at that. No pedals, no handlebars, no seat left on there. Oh wait, there's the handlebars. Oh, look at that, we got a dangler too. We got a little fish lure up in there. If we could see the brand on there, I wonder what the brand would be. It's probably so old, they didn't even have brands. Just the old green bike. <laughs> Oh, there we go. I just snapped something up. That feels decent too. Oh yeah. Oh, we got hanging here. Che oh, check it out you guys. Another piece of that white like plate material or something. But check this out you guys. This one here kind of looks like just a washer or something, nothing fancy, but this thing, man, hold on. Check this thing out, you guys. I don't know what the heck to think of that. There's got some kind of cap on top with maybe like some kind of, I don't know what you want to call that, some kind of lever. But then look at the bottom of this thing. It looks like, like two little stand pieces, like it would definitely stand up. I don't know what the heck to think of that. Oh, I think I'm on something again. I definitely am. Oh, oh, I'm smacking something else. Holy cow, there's like all kinds of stuff in here. What do we got here? Oh, look at that. That's one of them, uh, what do they call them? Them railroad J hooks. Oh yeah, no kidding, right here. Look at that, you guys. The old fishing spoon. That one's probably junk though. Maybe you could throw a new hook on there and it might be good. Then I thought this was a shotgun shell or something, you guys. Looks like just a little piece of piping or tubing. Then we caught this here, which I'm pretty sure is one of them fishing yeah, grappling yeah, hooks that you just found. And I'm pretty sure nowadays this is illegal to use, but back in the day, you guys, they would like tie a string to this and they would toss this out there and use this to try and snag fish. And then you guys, I had this thing on there. What do you think that is? That's like a, some kind of little shaft yeah, or something. Kinda, like, what would you call that? that a robot. I don't, I don't know. That's kind of crazy looking, you guys. Definitely some kind of attachment. Maybe yeah, you'd put a, a pin something. through there. Who the heck knows, man? Whoa, all kinds of rocks up in here or something. Unless that's stuff. That might actually be stuff I'm clicking on. Yeah, because I think I got some. Oh, dude. There's got to be all kinds of stuff in here. Yep, here we go. Oh, look at what it is, dude. I caught me the old pipe wrench. Look at that and a whole bunch of nails. My goodness, that's like a tiny one. I'm telling you guys, I'm feeling all kinds of stuff right behind these two boats here. This one is super rusted up, so you would definitely need to soak the heck out of this thing to get it working again. Er, er, er. Ooh, something, ain't it? Where'd that go? Come here, you little bugger. Oh, right there, I felt it click again. Oh, that really clicked. <laughs> that really clicked, dude, what is this? We seriously just got like really heavy. There's, I was gonna say there's got to be a couple things on there. Oh, holy cow, you guys, look at all this stuff. Oh, what is this? Oh, dude, I don't know why, but for some reason I thought this was like the barrel of a shotgun. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure this one here is just the old ugly pipe. But you guys, we got a bunch of stuff on here. Look at what else we got. 
What is that one? Another piece of ugly pipe. Get the heck out of here. But this big old sucker, what the heck is this? Oh, hold on, boats are rocking. Check this thing out. It almost looks like a flipping bird bath or something. But uh, it's got like three prongs coming off of here and you can see threads on there. It's a urinal. <laughs> Dude, it might be a urinal. This, this part would might screw into the wall or something. That'd be where you take your tinkle. That sucker is heavy, dude. I got me another something right behind the boat. One of these times I'm gonna catch a boat itself. Yeah, what am I? This is like pulling on me. Oh, whoa, whoa, it keeps coming. Oh, look it. Ah, it's one of them, uh, what you call it things. I've found a couple of these now. Every time I find it, I call it like the shuffleboard piece. <laughs> like the shuffleboard stick. Look at you guys. It's got the Y shape on there. I don't know what the heck this thing is, man, but I find. I found a couple of them now. It looks like a piece of junk, but the fact that I keep finding a bunch of them and they look exactly the same just really makes me wonder what the heck this is. And I'm pretty sure you guys, yeah, look at one, two, three of these fish grappling hooks on one throw. Holy smokes. Oh, I just seen a fish like come up right next to that boat. I'm, you might've even seen that on the camera. He came out right next to that boat. <laughs> the one I think I'm, I am too. I'm landing right on something. Like immediately. Here we go. Oh, that's heavy. I like me some heavy something. I like me a heavy something. Oh, look at the football. You know what this is, you guys? This is the old sad iron. You guys, we find so many of these sad irons all over the place. Most of them don't have the handle on there just like this one, but look at all that rust on there. Oh, dude, that's one of them drills. One of them hand drills. This might twist on. I tried pulling on it so it's not like an extension. What the heck is that? That's man? cool, man. That's a weird looking it's like one. a small drill. You guys, look at this little drill that Alex found, or we think it's like a hand drill. It looks like you put your hand here, one hand here, and drill whatever the heck you're gonna drill. That is super cool, man. Ooh, that felt good. Here we go. That was a good stick. What do we got this time? Oh, that's like, that's banging across the floor. Heck yeah, this sucker's heavy, you guys. Like really heavy. Whoa. Ooh, a couple things. First of all, look it. I got me a can hanging off the side of here, you guys. What kind of can you think we got? What does that say? Schlitz, ha <laughs> ha, check it out. We got the old Schlitz beer can. You can barely see the front of it. A Little bit of writing on there, but this sucker is pretty beat up, you guys. Missing the whole side. Now that's an old one, man. And then looks like we had us a big old boat with a couple washerushkis on there. Holy cow, what do you got? One, two, three, four, five washers on there? No shortage of washers on that bad boy. Look at, you can like use it as a kid's toy. <laughs> or one of them counter things. One, two, Three, four. Oh, look at that one, you guys. Couple things on there again. A little bit of, was that a knife? Oh, maybe not, a little bit of scrap. Looks like another big old stake or some kind of bolt or something there, the old square stake. But look at this, you guys. Looks like we caught, yep, the old grape soda can. Not much left of that sucker at all. Ooh, that's a little heavier. Just a little bit. What 
the heck is that? Look at that. There you guys. Oh, that's some kind of pulley. That's a super small one. Holy smokes. Yeah, you can see the groove in there. That's where your rope or uh, some kind of something would go. Huh, what the heck you think they were pulleying? Oh, look at that, you guys. I didn't even notice that at first. I thought it was just like a bolt or something, but no, you can see uh, grooves on there or like gears. That's a super teeny tiny gear piece. What the heck you think that one is? <laughs> at that one you guys i can tell what this is right away because again we have found tons of these you can see like the blade of it you guys this is an old ice skate you would attach this sucker to the bottom of your shoe oh what the heck it's another one of your it's a urinal i don't know not much left of this thing at all you guys looks like just the heel part or something i can just imagine like 50 60 70 years ago somebody was probably skating with this skate right here on the frozen water shh, shh, shh. Ooh, oh, look it. I found me some more of the old white stuff, you guys. And this one's part of a way bigger bowl. Check that one out. You can see part of the white and blue design. That's actually super cool looking. Man, it's too bad this thing is not fully intact because that would be so cool. Cook us up some river stew. Ooh, I'm dragging me something nice here. What could it be? Ooh. Oh, it is. Look at that, you guys. I found another piston head. And if you watched our last video here, we also found another one. And seriously, if you take a look around, I mean, you can see a couple houses, but otherwise there is not much going on out here at all. So the fact that we're finding automotive or what seems like engine parts all the way out here, this is pretty crazy. Ooh, something heavy. That, oh yeah, ooh, couple things on here, you guys. Holy cow, okay. First of all, aha, first of all, look at this. One little hinge, no way. Okay, look at, one teeny tiny hinge. Then we got a even bigger hinge, look at that sucker. Then we caught us another fish grappling hook. What the heck, man? Bunch of scrap bits and pieces, and then, we found this thing here, you guys. What the heck do you think of that? Got a little hole in the bottom, like you could maybe put a pin in there or lock it down, lock it in place or something. I have no clue. Oh, look what else is on there. I didn't even see that. What the, oh dude, that's a tape measure. Oh, look at it, it's like unfolding. Oh, look at it, it just exploded on me. But yeah, you guys, look at you can see the notches, 36. Holy cow, man, this is definitely like a little tape measure. Nah, -uh. dude. Look at that, you guys. I caught me another pipe wrench, but that one's even tinier yet. That one fits in my hand. Holy cow. Oh, and look at that too, dude. There's like some kind of wheel. That's definitely gotta be some kind of wheel. Maybe off an old toy car. Holy smokes, man. Heck yeah, you guys. This is the pipe wrench I found earlier, and this is the one I just found now. Look at that. It's a wrench fight. Oh, oh, get him, get him, get him. Here we go. What we got here, you guys? 
Ooh. Oh man, look it, it's one of them roller things, you guys. When we used to find them in the beginning, I used to think they were some kind of like printing roller or something like that. But after finding a few and reading your guys' comments, we now know that this is some kind of washboard roller. And I don't know what this material is, you guys, but this has come, it comes right off like paint. Super funky. Oh, what is that? I was gonna say, it looks like a piece of rubber. Heck yeah, you guys. Look it, I caught me part of the old bungee cord. I bet you a sucker would snap if you pull on her too hard. We only got one hook. You ain't strapping nothing down with that one. Now, in our last few videos here, we've been poking around this bridge for the most part, and we have been finding some seriously crazy stuff. These waters have been around longer than any of us, so there's no telling what's down there. We're not going to waste any time today. We're going to get right down to it. Let's start dipping this magnet around, and let's see if we can find anything today. Today, I'm going to start way down the shoreline more because I see a sign here that says public hunting and fishing grounds. So we're going to start off down the shoreline here we're gonna work our way towards this bridge we're gonna go down river and we're just gonna see what we can find here today it looks like we're out in the middle of nowhere here but i bet you we're still gonna find some stuff you guys i almost need one of them uh what do you call it how do you say that a bimini top like an umbrella that goes over the boat. I got this umbrella here, but uh, you gotta be sitting down for it to work. Oh, dude. See, this is exactly what I'm talking about, you guys. Right in front of the public hunting and fishing ground sign. Not sure if you can really see that. Heck yeah, you guys. First finds of the day. This is literally my second throw. So who knows? Maybe this whole shoreline had factories or something. I mean, really, who knows? Pretty cool, you guys. We got us the super old gear piece. What the heck you think that one came off of? Other than that, you guys, looks like a little piece of piping, a little nail, and maybe a little piece of scrap metal. Just a little bit of cash money. I can't believe we already found something. Honestly, I'm not even going to lie to you. All the way out here in the middle of who the heck knows. I think I'm on something again. Okay, we might, uh, we might be on to something here. I seen some scrap on the shoreline, you guys, on the way over here. And it was just an ugly piece of scrap, but it kind of made me think, well, if there's scrap on the shoreline, what the heck's in the water? Right here. No kidding. My very next throw. Oh my gosh, you guys, this might actually not be a bad spot. What do we got going on here? Whole bunch of funky looking stuff. What is that, a green shell? I don't like green eggs and ham, Sam I am. But look at this, you guys, holy smokes, little debris piece, nothing too fancy there. Another chunk of who knows what the heck that is. Is this a piece of coil or a piece of pipe? No, that's definitely a spring or some kind of coil. Heck yeah, you guys, check that one out. Still got part of a little hook on the bottom. That's a short stubby one. Then we caught us another little piping piece, maybe another bolt there, and then, what the heck do you think this thing is? I have no clue. The old put something in there and pinch her down bracket piece. I'm not too sure, you guys. Super rusted out, super old looking. Heck yeah, you guys, there is some stuff in here, man, right along the shoreline. Heck yeah, you guys, let's keep tossing. See what other juicy finds we can come up with. Did I just like land on something? I think so. You have got to be kidding me. I'm sure there might be some rocks and maybe logs or something in here too. There's got to be, I'm sure. Yeah, here we go. Ain't it? Yes. Oh my gosh. You guys, literally my next throw again. Oh, holy cow. Look at, there is a ton of stuff going on here. First things first. What the heck you think that little arm looking piece is off of? Oh my goodness. You guys, what on earth? There is so much stuff here. What is it? Oh, I know what these are. We've definitely caught a couple of these before you guys. I'm pretty sure these are uh, pistons from literally an engine. Do, 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 do. Pretty crazy, you guys. I can't believe how much stuff we're pulling out here already. And then there's this thing. 
some kind of arm that you could like put a pin through again we found a couple of these these funky looking shafts got some threads on there i don't know what to think of these things you guys but again it seems automotive other than that you guys bunch of debris on there maybe a little bracket looking piece holy smokes i almost never get this lucky you guys these are literally my first couple throws and i'm like landing right on stuff that's crazy i just seen this public hunting and fishing sign and I figured we'll stop here and give her a shot. But if you think about it, it's public. So anybody could come and go here over the years, you know? Boats pulling up, people swimming. I mean, really, there's no telling. I got something again, dude. Oh, oh, whoa. That's good. That, is that not a keyhole or some kind of locking hole? Oh, look at it. It looks like a pulley. Yeah, it definitely is. Like you could run a rope or a string or something on there. Heck yeah, man. We caught us the old mystery pulley. Do you guys, this is insane. Already, right off the bat, just nailing stuff. Back to back. Here we go. Can we do it again? I think we can. I can feel some stuff. It feels like a, a lot of stuff down there. It's just a matter of getting getting it to click right. Is that something? No? Oh, it is. Oh, look at that one, you guys. I thought I felt something, but that's almost not even feelable. Look at that. We got us uh, some kind of funky looking wheel. What do you think that came off of? Like the old office chair or maybe like a workbench with rolling wheels? There is no telling, you guys. Again, super cool. Obviously, something was going on here. Right off the bat, back to back, we are finding some pretty cool stuff. Nice. Oh, here we go. That's something. It's, you guys, it's literally every throw. I'm not kidding. Here we go. Oh, what's this? Whoa, what is that actually? What do you think that is? Does that not look like some kind of handle or lever? Oh, I broke it now. Or did I break it? Yeah, it opens up like that. Yeah, no, that's how it's supposed to open, I think. Look it. What the heck is that, you guys? I thought that looked like some kind of lever or handle. Maybe some kind of water pump. Er, er, er. I have no clue. That's super funky looking, you guys. And there was a little something else on there. What is that? Just an ugly chunk of scrap. See, now I don't think that side of the river is public because, yeah, I see somebody's camper. I'm almost positive that's private over there. Here we go. I just grabbed something. Oh, I just stuck something else now. Oh, hold on, hold on. That's a backbreaker. One second. Come here. No, 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 no. Come here. Yes. I want this. I want this. Give it here. What is this? Oh, yes, you guys. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. I got. I think I have something else on here. Hold on. First of all, what is this? There's something heavy in here, you guys. I gotta throw my magnet back in there quick so I don't lose the spot. Hold on. Pretty sure it was like right here somewhere. But check this thing out, you guys. Looks like the head of a bolt or something here. But then there's like little cup areas for something to go into. I don't know what that would be. Some kind of bracket piece off of something. And maybe whatever this heavy thing is could explain what we just pulled this off of. Pretty funky, you guys. We are pulling some weird stuff out of here. Now, where's that big thing? Probably gonna have a hard time finding it. I got something else. You have got to be kidding me. Holy cow. Yeah, you guys, I found us a little hot spot. No doubt. Heck yeah. Oh, you know what this is? Look it, because I can see the wood. I'm pretty sure this is part like the neck of the head of a shovel. Everything has fallen completely off of a shovel. The only thing left of it is the neck. Other than that, you guys, again, bunch of little random scrap pieces going on here. Like, check this thing out with the hole in it. I don't know what you want to think of that one. Random little cutout. I 
I'm literally, I have to be landing right on the stuff because it's like heavy immediately. Yeah. What do we got here? Holy big old bracket piece off of something. Oh, look at that. Some kind of cable here. Is that some kind of ground wire and some kind of framing piece? You guys, huh? And then we found engine pistons and like engine parts. Could you imagine if there's like some kind of old school vehicle, like an old buggy or something in here? I mean, that's, I, I'm not a, no expert or nothing, but that looks like a ground wire to me, you guys. Off of what? I guess, who knows? Ooh, there's weight. A little bit of weight. That's actually pretty heavy. <laughs> Holy cow. What are we pulling? Why does that look like wood? <laughs> you guys, there are so many weird, random, mostly scrap looking pieces coming out of here, but I mean, it's like wood. Something with the wood mixed with the metal. And then looks like this big old long, ugly scrap piece here, bunch of scrap. But check this thing out, you guys. Is this some kind of super old school brake pad? I have no clue, man. Kind of what that looks like. Oh, here we go. Couple things on there again, you guys. First of all, I thought this one had some color. Yeah, look at that. That's like the bowl or plate material. And this one's kind of curved. So I'm guessing we caught us like part of a super old bowl or maybe a teapot. I mean, who knows really what it is. Super cool. Then we caught this thing here. The old ribbed looking piece. It almost looks like half of a pipe or something. That's kind of funky looking. And then we had this thing, you guys. What the heck you think that one is there? It's got a couple lips on there. It looks like maybe it could be a lid for something. And then maybe that's like some kind of handle. I don't know, you guys. There we go. Another couple somethings on there. You guys, is that another piston head? The head's all smushed up, so it's kind of hard to tell, but I'm starting to think, I don't know, I don't know. I was gonna say maybe there's an engine in here, but then again, we seem to find them things literally everywhere. Bunch of little bits and debris as usual, but then we had this thing. This is definitely some kind of knob, like for sure. Who knows off of what, you guys? That's how you used to roll up your windows back in the day. <laughs> oh, would that be like a motorcycle handle or a peg, a motorcycle foot peg? I don't know, you guys. Now I got all kinds of questions. Let's keep tossing. spark plug you guys every single throw is just tons of the weirdest bits and pieces most of them i don't even know if i are worth showing you but it's every throw we're finding tons of random stuff like this look at this spark plug what do we got there janesville well check that one out looks like it snapped at the bottom there we cost the old spark a rooney bzz, bzz. Ooh. I think I landed on something. Yes. Pull nice and easy here so we don't pop off. But there's definitely something on here. Faux show, baby. I love it when that happens. You don't even have to drag far. Oh, oh that's actually kind of heavy. What do we got? Ooh, couple things going on here, you guys. First of all, we'll start with the ugliest looking piece first. Uh, just an ugly looking piece of scrap. Cash money. Then we had this little thing falling off of here. What the heck is that going on there? I don't know what to think of this. Oh, if you look at this piece here, that's definitely like a hinge 
piece. Well, I snapped it now. Like you could run a strap through there, maybe some kind of strap tie down. I don't really know. But then you guys, yep, that's exactly what I thought. We caught another one of these funky looking pieces with like the lever on there. Er, er, er. The old pump lever. I don't know what to think of this thing. That's all I can think of is that this has got to be some kind of pump or some kind of lever or maybe some kind of is this like one of them old train track switches where you pull the two levers? That's like something you see in the movies and you switch the tracks. I have no clue, you guys. But now we found us a second one. See, look at the end here. It almost does look like a pipe kind of really weird. There we go. That's pretty heavy. Yeah. Wow, just every throw is so much debris and stuff, you guys. Oh, look at, is that part of like a, some kind of wheel? You can, it looks like some spokes on there almost. Then check this thing out, you guys. It definitely looks like some kind of, yeah, there's like a hook on the end of there. What the heck? Talk about a hat hanger, baby. Check that one out. Well, that one's pretty funky, you guys. Some kind of hook. Who knows what that came off of? Of course, a ton of debris on here, but we had this thing. What is that? You can see like some threads on the end there, screws on to something, like the arm for something. Tons of little itty bitty pieces coming out of there. My goodness. Oh, that's actually pretty heavy. Oh, whoa, 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 hold up, hold up. That's not gonna come up, is it? Oh, it is. Oh, whoa, there's a couple things. Oh, oh, wait a minute, what the? It just keeps coming, you guys. Oh my goodness, look it. That is definitely a rim because you can see part of the spokes on there. And actually the closer I look, that looks like a big old wooden spoke. I think something like this honestly might've came off like an old horse and buggy. I'm not even kidding you. You might think I sound crazy, but I think that's what that is you guys. And then right next to it, we caught another one. Holy cow, you guys, is there an entire like buggy down there? That would be absolutely insane, man. Oh, wait a minute. This one, I don't see any wooden spokes and this one actually looks different. Yeah, these two don't look the same. Now that is super cool. Ooh, here we go. Couple things going on here. First of all, look at this, you guys. I'm pretty sure I have found something that looks similar to this before. And I think there's a second one on here. Yeah, that's exactly what that is. This one snapped. So look at that, you guys. We found two of these things. What the heck are these? Do they go together? It kind of looks like it. A little half ring somethings. What the heck are those? And then we had this thing on there. At first, it looked like just the old washer. Uh, but it's got like a little lip on there and we got a bunch of holes. What the heck do you think that one is? I think I'm dragging something here. Sure feels like it. Oh yeah. A little bit of something anyways. Holy cow, you guys, again. I mean, literally every throw, it's just the most random looking pieces. Like what the heck is that for? But look at this one. That again, looks like some kind of ground cable or like a connection wire. Like something you would see on my boat battery. Only that sucker looks super old. Look at that one, holy cow. <laughs> you guys, I wanna keep moving down the shoreline, but holy cow, we just keep finding stuff. That's heavy. Oh yeah, here we go. 
Yeah, here we go. What is this one? Look at this thing, you guys. I don't know. I don't know, man. This has got to be coming off of something. I just keep throwing it in the same area. It's almost like we're just plucking something off of something. Huh, some kind of shaft off of something, man. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Whoa, what is that? Some kind of frame off of something. The old picture frame looking. It almost looks like a window frame, actually. Part of a window frame. I don't know what this would be. That's a funky looking piece. The old window frame blaster. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. Some kind of big old funky, two big old funky looking pieces. First of all, what do you think this one is? Man, everything is just so rusted. There is no telling what this is. I think there's a little bit of wood on there. Not much to go off of there. And then we caught this thing here, you guys, which I thought looked like some kind of pulley again. It almost kind of looks like it. Oh, wait a minute. This is like, it almost looks like the base of a swivel something, maybe a swivel chair, like this piece here would rotate. I don't know what that is, but like the base of some kind of rotating something. I am like absolutely floored how much stuff is seriously in here, like just right next to the woods. What the? All right, you guys, my camera died because it was too hot. We just took us a little break. It cooled down a little bit now check out this thing i found here first of all i'm pretty sure this is half of a horseshoe the old horseshoe pistol just a one halfer but look at this thing i swear i mean this piece here obviously looks like uh like it would bracket or bolt onto something but does this not look like propellers like like that would spin that sure is what that looks like there is some weird stuff in here oh that slapped you could probably see the magnet like pull out of my hand quick there yeah whoa oh what is that yo that's like a canister or something yeah whoa look at that what the heck? It's not open on either end. So what the heck is this? I think this is like fully sealed. Oh, and look at what else is on there. That's definitely like an ore holder. Maybe there was a boat that flipped here. Who the heck knows? But this thing, you guys, look at this big old thing. First, I thought it was like a big old pipe, but uh, no, I don't know what's going on with this. Looks like you could maybe turn that and open this up. I have no clue. <laughs> Can't really tell if there's anything in there. Could you imagine if this is sealed shut and there's like something in there? I don't know. It's like a lot of big old scary rocks here, but I got some. <laughs> yeah, whoa. What in the world is that? Oh, snap! We're gonna put a hole in the boat! It almost looks like some kind of brake disc or something, or I don't know, some kind of hubcap, something. So I'm sure this thing was sitting at the bottom of the river just like this in the mud, and then over the years, it just crossed it over into this. Unreal! Who knows what that is? What do you guys think? Some kind of disc plate? Something. Maybe it's some kind of grinding wheel? It really is. It's just hard to tell with all the rust. Huh. Oh, red, what is that? Oh, it's a pocket knife, dude, score. Heck yeah. And look at how rusted together that thing is. See, now we're behind this property here with the two boats and the little boat launch. And this area, if you remember, is where we ended up in our last videos in this area. Super cool, you guys. A Little bit of soaking, a little bit of scrubbing. You could get this thing working brand new.
Ooh, something here. What do we got here, you guys? It almost looks like a, a barrel or something, but the more you look at it, I don't really think it could be because it would have like this opening in here. What the heck is that? Definitely could have been very big. Huh. I think I stuck something right off the rocks there. No kidding. Yeah, that's actually pretty heavy. Hold on. Oh my. Right off the rocks. What do we got? No, really? We caught the old ax head and look at that. There's not a handle, not even a chunk of the handle on there. Holy smokes, man. That actually makes it 10 times easier to like refurbish this one. All you gotta do is take the rust off, sharpen it up and pop a new handle on there. The old chopper. Oh, something slapped right there. Just about the same spot I just found that ax head. This is, whoa, no, that's heavy. That's heavy. Hold on, we don't want to crash here. This is heavy. Like really heavy. Oh, jackpot, buddy. Look at what it is. Any day of the week, you guys. These are one of my favorite things to find. The old cash money anchor. Cold hard cash. Oh, look at that one, man. What does that say on the side of there? Puppet minnow. Ha, check that out. It actually looks like a uh, ice fishing lure. Ah, oh, but the hook is broke off the bottom and the way it's broke, there is no replacing that. The old junk jig. Get me away from this boat. Goodness, we are gonna smack. Oh, look at that. I was gonna say, it looks like just a pipe on there. Just a little cash money pipe, but, oh, and then first of all, look at, that's one of them fish grappling hooks. We have pulled tons of these suckers out of here. No doubt back in the day, they must have been snagging all kinds of fish. But look at what else was on there. This is definitely a wrench. My goodness, that one's been down there for a while. I don't think you ain't fixing nothing with this one. That's heavy. Holy cow. Dude, are you kidding me right now? There's no way. Is that another rim? I don't think so. Right here kind of looks like some kind of locking mechanism, maybe. Or no, look at that's wood. There's some more wood on the inside of this metal frame. Yup. What is that, man? Again, another some kind of rim? Wow. This is literally like a rim city. Look at that. The whole top of the cart just rim, rim, rim. Whoa, look at that. What is that? That's gotta be some kind of crank or some kind of handle for something. What do you guys think? No doubt. Wow, yeah, look at, oh, I didn't even notice that at first. That's a wooden handle for sure. Wow, that's pretty cool. Maybe off of some kind of machine. I don't really know. The old cranker. Oh, ho, ho. I just watched a bird poop not even three feet from the boat. Boy, that was close. Whoa, what the heck? 
What is that, you guys? That's an S. What do you think that came off of? It almost looks like a button, like a, maybe off a typewriter or something, ain't it? Now that's pretty cool. Yet again, another super successful day out at the old country bridge. You guys, it's amazing how much stuff just keeps coming out of there. 95 degrees out here today. I am absolutely burnt to a crisp. So I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, guys. If you enjoyed this video today, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me. And don't forget to subscribe, guys. Make sure to stay tuned and I will catch you on the next one.